sir. Hey! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Here, they got two people just scrambling. Dribble, bro. Hey! Mm. Okay, fans, your boy could be here. People have been asking me about this build over and over and over again. I'm about to finally show y'all because I've been using this like my main build, so I use it all the time. But this is my build I've been using. It's a three three level threat. It's my slasher. I call it a slasher. People are like, yeah, you don't get enough land. You don't get enough land. So I got 96 dunk though. So this is my 96 dunk build. I'm gonna show you how I made it, and let's get into it right now. Let's get it. So. You know, handing this jersey number don't matter. You're hot it is. Shooting guard. You can make a shoot guard or a small forward. I decided to make him a shooting guard. Because I'm always a shooting guard. And they always even put me at small forward too. If I'm at small forward, if I got another shooting guard. So it don't matter to me if you do small forward shooting guard. But 6'8 is the preferred. My preferred thing because mine is different. I'm not just no regular, you know, no regular just dunker. You know, I got some shooting. But I'm not one of the people that got all that, you know, layups. And, not layups, but, uh. You know the low three pointers, the low all that crap. I need a specific jumper. That's my jumper. I do my jumpers. So I'll show you the jumper too in the video. I'll give you that. Weight at 186. 186. Don't know how. Oh, I did 186 for. I don't know why I did 186. Oh, for the speed, I think. Yeah, something like that. So 186 is speed. Wait, 186 is the weight. Seven foot wingspan because right now it's, it gives you a mid range of a 91. I could do 91. It don't matter, but I wanted 92 because I wanted a specific jump shot. I wanted a Kobe jump shot, but I ended up adjusting to the Real Allen jump shot, which I have now. So you can do 91, which is how my jump shot is. You only got to have a 91. So I did 92. So I might do the same thing. I think, what is, do you get anything different? Oh, you get Mini Magician on Hall of Fame, I think, at 92. Yeah. So I need, you get Mini Magician on Hall of Fame. So that's one reason I do have the 92 as well. So first of all, we go 96 dunk. We ain't got to do nothing else. 96 dunk, you ain't got to touch nothing else. You could do close shot at 62. And then, you know, rest of that, you keep that. I got driver lamp at 77. So I get float game on gold. You really don't need float game because you ain't gonna be doing no floaters. You're gonna be dunking on everybody. You'll be dunking on everybody. Everybody. I'm not sitting there gonna be using layups. So you can bring the layups down to 70 if you want, well, as low as you can go. 76, as low as you can go. You can do 76, but I'm gonna show you 77. Cause that's how my build is. Standard dunk at 41. I get standard dunks all the time with only a 41. I don't even got it. I don't even got standard dunks equipped because I got a high driver layup. I get the standard dunk. So sorry, I had to do something. All right, I get the standard dunks regardless. Mid range shot going automatically to a 92. You see all these gold badges. You see all these Hall of Fame badges. I get all of those just for 92. I ain't got to touch nothing else. <laughs> My three point is at an 80. I did an 80 just because that's how I feel comfortable with an 80. I don't, you don't have to be 80. You could do a 70, you know, whatever you get you corner specials in 83, 76. Most people do 76 just because it gives you agent three and corner specials on silver. I did 80. It's probably wasted points, but that's just me. I feel comfortable at an 80. That's just me. I say you can go 83, 84 if you want to, but they don't give you nothing. Uh, free throw 87. That's what I had left over, but we're going we gonna to show you. I'll show you. I'll be at 73 for now. Pax accuracy is a 60. If you know how to pass with IQ, 60 is all you really need. I ain't gonna say 60 is all you need. You can do 70. A 60 is slow, but with, with elite, you get that two-way tenacity. <laughs> two-way tenacity, you on defensive plays and get steals and stuff, yeah, you get a good. boost to your attributes so your passes are much faster as well. So 60 is nice, 
But then when you get that, you know, defensive player or anything on the defense, it's a nice pass, a little faster, you know what I'm saying? But 60 is fine for me. I know how to maneuver my passes when I, you know, most people don't. My ball handle is at 80. It does what I needed to do. The dribble moves I got is fine. I get unpluggable on silver, ankle breaker on silver, and you get 75 speed with ball. It gives you, you already get automatic pro, but I did it for just because I, just in case I didn't like pro, Magic Johnson, but Magic Johnson was already patched or patched right when I did did this build. So it already didn't match about Magic Johnson, but I did 75. Oh no, I think 75 Zach Zavine dribble style. That's what I wanted, but I end up using pro. I use pro a lot now, so I don't even worry about it. So I go interior defense at 55. So, you know, I don't even got interior defense up right now, but when I do, it is a 55. So then I can handle myself in the handle in the paint, you know, handle other people that try to go in the paint. I do it right now with just, you know, handle stand up, you 25. Regardless of how you do it, it works the way it's supposed to do. So well, actually, it don't work how it's supposed to. It's just the way if you take, if you get make, if you get good positioning, it works, you know, just the way the game is, you know, you can be 225 interior and still be in front of somebody. As long as there ain't no somebody with a higher, high finishing, but you can do with the, you can do the job. All right, perimeter defense, I did 80. 80, I know it's tough for some, but you get off ball press on go. You know, if you know how to play defense, you know how to play defense, you can stop people. If you don't, I will go to 85. But if you can stop people, go 80. Sometimes you're gonna get blown by. They got high blow by, they gonna blow right past you. But you know, sometimes you can hold your own. You just gotta be able to predict when necessary. My steal is at 85. I get steals all the time. I think 85 is really the sweet spot. People like going to 91. But at this build, you can't get to 91. You're gonna go to 88. So 91 won't happen for me because my arm, my arm, my wingspan. I have no block. I think the block, it, it comes up eventually with something else. I'm gonna leave that alone so you can see it. My speed is an 80. Speed is an 80. Acceleration is a 74. My strength is a 74 for physical handles on gold and bulldozer. Well, actually it's for, yeah. 73 here, you physical handles on gold. 74 is bulldozer. Bulldozer helps on those guys that have zero strength at all. And I be giving them bulldozer with go with bronze, bro. It's crazy. Uh, my vertical is at 86, which is required for all contact dunks. And then my stamina goes up to 96. Oh, what, 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 something went up, I ain't supposed to. What happened? Oh, okay, hold on. Block should be at 31. Off of rebound should be at 26. I must have pulled up some. Defensive rebound 38, and it should go all the way to 96. 96. All right, and then you take the leftovers and send it to free throw. Oh no, Santa Duncan be at. There you go, 41. Leftovers go up to free throw is 87, and that is the build. I'm gonna show you what I would edit because I'm about to make this build again. But with a 96 driving dunk, this is my build. I dunk on everybody. Y'all gonna see all the clips. It's all in here. You press A. This is what you get. You're gonna get shades of. Austin Reeves, DeJounte Murray, and Doug Christie. Three level threat. This is the three level threat. I mean, it do it all. I mean, you can hit phase, you hit mid range. I mean, you hit mid range, I hit phase from the three. I had a 60 point game, 69 point game. I mean, I'm, I, I go crazy with this deal. I dunk for everybody. You know, you master, master the precision dunk meter, you go crazy. But I'm going to change this build and edit it. So if you decided to edit it, you, can, you know what to do. You bring this down to about. I'll say just to have acrobat on silver, I'll keep it at 76. Keep that on 76. You can bring that down to a 94. Well, yeah, bring that down to a 94. Bring this down to 82. So you can have that, or you can have regular off two. Other one, you get off one, but you really don't do off ones too much. So I'm going to bring this up to 84. My perimeter defense comes up to an 87. So I get challenger on gold now. Challenger is now on gold because I want more defense. Because sometimes, I'm, sometimes I'm, I get put at point guard and I gotta guard the point guard. So I'd rather have my challenger higher than what it is now, which is only on bronze. <laughs> so, I mean, this is the build that I'm working with right now. I'm still looking to change some things. Um, I'm probably gonna add probably, you know, some more acceleration. Other than that, that's it. That is the build and it should come out as a, it should come out as a, oh, here, with the free throw. Actually, I can do that. 
I don't need 99. Let's see if I can get this to 90. Give me gold. Yep. All right. So this should come out as a two way three level threat. Probably the same shades, same shades, different order, but or the same order, but it's a two way three level threat. The exact same way, just a lower dunk, just a little bit lower dunk for the context. You can do that way. I like the two way three level threat. I could go. I got. Like I said, I got gold challenger. I got all everything you need. I mean, for me at least, you can't get a ninety one steel like I told you because your arm length, your wingspan too short. But if you don't, if you don't want to do the ninety, you know, ninety two for mid range. I mean, midi magician hall of fame. You don't have to. You can do ninety one. That's just me though. I don't. You don't have to do what I do. You can go eighty eight and do. You know, most people want the T Mac jumper anyway and do eighty eight, and then you know fiddle and diddle. You know, with some stuff. But me. I want the 91. I mean, 92. That's because the jumper I have. Plus, I like Midi Magician Hall of Fame. I go crazy with that. So I go 80. If you went 88, and then I said, all right, you can bring the wingspan up. You bring the wingspan up, and now you can go and get that 91, 91 steel. You know what I'm saying? Bring this down. Oh, you got to, you know, fiddle with some stuff. Bring the acceleration down. Boom. You got that now. And then. You really got everything else is free roaming at that point. Look at that. Free roaming. You can do whatever you want with the other attributes. But you got the 91 seal. And you got the 88. You know, you got your T Mag if you want the T Mag. You go look. 90 89 for blinders. Also, you get the oh, if you do let's say 90. Which one gets you the Okay, Dead Eye is 90. So if you want go Dead Eye and go Blinders too. Go all the fame up and looks. There you go. 90. It's all on you. Like I said, it's all on you. That's, that's the build. If you want some more videos from your boy, subscribe, 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 hit the like button. We out of here. This is the three level threat or the two way three level threat. It's your boy QB. I am signing out. Thank you for watching. Be blessed. If you want some more, hit the subscribe button. Comment down below if you would use this build or people been asking, like I said, people been asking on TikTok, Instagram, and on YouTube, what's this build? So I'm showing it right now. This is your boy. I'm going to show you right now. I do have him at 92. So I'm showing and what he looking like at 92. So if you want to do them just for a 92 and under build, this is my 92 and under build for when I run solos. I run no squads a lot. I run regular squads a lot. And I play at, I play with them over 99, you know, over 92 with my friends or, you know, with two others into randoms. But I do fine. So if you want to see what the build looks like, here you go. This is my 92. I am purple. If you need to know, I'm purple. All right, so progression. This is how I got them. I can't move nothing. If I move them, we go to 93. So this is the build. Like, I'm not lying about it. But when I get my VC up, I'm going to make that two way three level three, which is next. And this is going to be my 92 and under build. And that other build is going to be my 99 build. This is my jump shot. I use Ray Allen. You can't get Ray Allen unless you are starter three. But I unlock Ray Allen is 89, 89 mid range or 89 three pointer required. Kobe Bryant and Kyle Corbett is my releases. It gives you a C plus, A plus, A plus, and A minus. I mean, it's on you. Like I said, you can do a bunch of stuff. I got some other ones I could show. I mean, I did what you can do it with. Uh, I got one with Oscar Robinson that gives you all A's. I tried. I really didn't. I didn't dig it too much. But I mean, if it works for you, it works for you. It's a 91 steal. I mean, the, both, the jump shot regardless is going to be a 91. So my jump shot is a 91. You gotta have a 91 regardless so if you don't have a 91 mid range or three-pointer you can't get this jump shot so i mean you gotta say you can also get some other jump shots you ain't gotta get what i have just like if i did my t-mac jump shot i think my t-mac was that it has to be a 90 requirement because the releases i like but in that if you want the release cue i usually wait till his hand get flat right about his head and push it away that's the release cue i know how love some people like to know that and that's it it's your boy QB. I am signing out. Thank y'all for watching. Be blessed. Peace.